Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's see what is happening. This is the Ophiosis reading. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Um, this is the Gemini reading. Ophiosis, you um, could be having a wonderful time. This is um, the energy of um, the Gemini season. Geminis are, uh, could be helping you to resolve a whole lot of issues. So we see defeat. We see um, the barkment, which is the um, Seven of Cups. So a lot of you are dealing with an Aquarian, a Scorpion, um, Six of Swords, another Aquarian. Um, a lot of you are dealing with some sort of an investigation, but you, Ophiosus, is going to be successful overcoming a situation. So let's say that you are an auditor. Um, you're a for forensic detective. Um, however, this is coming up that you are analyzing and investigating something. You are going to be very, very successful. If you're a researcher, you're going to be uh, um, finding out or uh, creating or be a successor with your research. Okay, there is no question about that. Ophiosis, whatever is transpiring and is happening, a lot of you Ophiosis are... Um, conditionally recognizing what was happening and transpiring. So I see the energy of the five of swords and let's check that energy out. This is the week, the first week, a week of the 21st until the 27th. Um, you are dealing with the energy of the five of swords. Now the five of swords is Venus in Aquarius, Venus in Aquarius. And this is that you, Ophiosa, stood your ground. And um, Venus in Aquarius is about you stand your ground against a Taurus and a Libran. You are standing your ground against a Taurus and a Libran. And you have overcome what a Taurus and a Libran has done. Now, whatever the situation that was going on, a Taurus and a Libran was kind of raining and it's kind of and kind of tried to get away with something, and you have defeat the Taurus and the Libran. So it's a situation where you and you were dealing with some sort of a communication. This is about communication, and this is about researching and looking at something. And it's as if you had some sort of a debate at the workplace with a Taurus and a Libran, or you were in some sort of a partnership, or some sort of a business deal, or some sort. Of but whoever the Taurus and this Libran is, you have defeated them because this um, Five of Swords is in the upright and it's Venus in Aquarian. Now, you're an Ophiosus person and you were dealing with these two people and battling a situation um, via communication. And you were battling with this Taurus and this Libran because this Taurus could have done something these two people could have collaborated together and created a whole lot of issue and a whole lot of problem. And you are standing your ground and you're saying, hey, you know, I'm looking at this situation and it's as if, you know, you're examining a situation what a Taurus and a Libra did. And basically, these people were trying to um, create a whole lot of issue. And then you are recognizing, no, no, no. So as a lot of you could be having battles or communication debates with a Libran, uh, a Tor, uh, with a Libran, um, a Taurus and a Scorpion. Okay. And, and it is a serious situation because you Ophiosus, um, or an Leo and you Ophiosus are really communicating to the people and you're like, you know, I am seeing, because it's like a Leo, uh, a Taurus. Um, then we have the Aquarians uh, that could be helping you. And, you know, they're going to be recognizing what these people have created. And I see in this first week, you're going to be um, speaking up. And um, this is no defeat. You are defeating these people who have been created. You're defeating a Leo. You're defeating a Taurus. Uh, um, you're defeating an Aquarian and you're defeating a Scorpion in one move and in one hit because of what they have done. All right. So let's look at the second week. The second week is the 28th until um, the 3rd. And then the second um, week you have 
um, the Seven of Cups. Now, the energy of the Seven of Cups, so this is uh, um, emotional. The Seven of Cups is, uh, yeah, a Leo is going to be fired. Uh, yeah, a Leo is going to be fired. Then we have Venus in Scorpion. They're going to be choosing for the Scorpion because they're going to be recognizing that a Leo tried to create some sort of a problem for a Scorpion. And I see that people are going to be choosing for the Scorpion. So I see a Taurus, um, and, and, and a Taurus and a Libra. They're going to be choosing for the Scorpion because they're going to be recognizing the undesirable play of a Leo and what a Leo did to a Scorpion. Okay. So, it is the battle of these people and it's as if you, Ophiosus, are the one that is trying to savor in this situation and trying to resolve this situation because there you are dealing with a Taurus and the Taurus seems to be coming up because Venus is governed by the Tauruses and the Libran and the Taurus seems to be coming up in the Libran and it's as if you, Ophiosus, are the one who is... Checking out and investigating a situation and recognizing what a Taurus, a Libran, um, a Leo have done to a Scorpion. And you are now recognizing that all these three people, the Leo, and a tower moment is coming on for the Leo because they're going to be recognizing that this Leo, um, have been creating chaos for the for the for the scorpion and is blocking the scorpion for something and, and a lot of you are not going to be finding out why and is that the leo has a lot of secrets the leo um cv or communication documentation is not theirs they're going to be recognizing that the leo has been using the scorpion information for a very long time they're going to be recognizing that uh, um, the Scorpion have found out what a Leo have done and how a Leo have access uh, some sort of a data and information. And that is why they have been given the Scorpion a very hard time. And I see you, Ophiosus, is going to be recognizing the Scorpion has been, um, basically targeted. And you are going to be getting involved in the situation in order to resolve the situation because you recognize that these three people were overpowering um, and this Leo was very dishonest. They're going to be recognizing that this Leo could have falsified some sort of information and was trying to make it look like as if it was a scorpion. So it's a sick mental sick game that a whole lot of people was playing against a scorpion and I see you Ophiosus is going to be stepping in in the second week and he's going to be resolving this because you recognize this is really really sick what these people have done to a scorpion so I see tower moment is coming down for a Leo there is no question about this a real tower moment they're going to be firing a Leo on the spot um, and they're going to be choosing for the scorpion you uh, Ophiosus is going to be recognizing what this Leah has done to the Scorpion um, and what the Taurus, that the Taurus together with the Leo had created a whole lot of issue for the Scorpion and have manipulated a situation and you're going to be stepping in um, in there. In um, the third week, the third week is from the 4th until the 10, what you're dealing with, the Six of Swords, science. So here is where it, it started now. Uh, people are now recognizing the Six of Swords is about uh, um, you, Ophiosus, really getting to the bottom of a situation that is transpiring. Mercury in Aquarian. So this is definitely analyzing a situation, investigating a situation, getting to directly the in the you you are you are get into the ground and get into the balance of this situation because now you're recognizing um, that there has been some sort of uh, secrecy that people at the workplace was carrying out. But hold on, hold on, um, Ophiosus. You're going to be also recognizing that they have been also using science, black magic and witchcraft to um, create chaos and I see you, Ophiosus, because you, Ophiosus, uh, have the energy of uh, 
uh, cleansing this sort of a situation. So you're going to be identifying the people that has been using witchcraft, black magic to either keep their jobs, stay in a position or has been using it against other people. And it's as if some of you Ophios is just going to be sitting and someone walk past or, you know, you, you sit in a room with people and you just start to see, um, the, the, the negative energy and the energy that they have placed around them to create, um, and, and create chaos. So you're going to be recognizing the people that has been using witchcraft and black magic to actually hold their position at the workplace and who was using it against other people. To remove other people. You're, you are now going to be recognizing Jesus. There is really truth about this, this, um, the negative forces that people use negative forces in order to stay in their jobs and to stay in their position and get position. Cause I'm seeing it now. And it's as if you're going to be recognizing, it's as if some of you are thinking, is this true? Um, does people really use? Yes, they do. And a lot of you are going to be recognizing, oh, so they use science to manipulate other people and to get what they have desire. And I see you, Ophiosis is going to be saying, no more. It's not happening. This is not how we're going to be doing it. No, no, no. And I see you, Ophiosis, because you, Ophiosis, have... Uh, um, this sort of a healing eye of power, you are going to be getting this and said, no, we are not going to be doing this. Um, you people are not going to be getting away with this. You're not going to be winning this by using negative forces to control other people and control situation. And I see some of you opiosos, anyone that you recognize, because it's as if this is how people find out their divine purpose. It's like things like this happen. And even if you never believed and then you started seeing this, because of course you thinking, can this really happen in the nighttime as you go to bed? Because some people start thinking about these things. You're going to be recognizing that it's true. And you're going to be asking how to release the situation. Because it's like a lot of you opios says, hey, I'm getting to the bottom of this and I'm taking this thing down. It's not going to be happening. So whoever was using witchcraft and black magic to get whatever position and to, um, you know, work against other people in order for other people not to move forward. Guess what? It is ending. So I see a lot of you are going to be, um, as successful and become a star to show up something and letting people be alert about what was happening and what was transpiring. And it was a situation that people recognize that sometimes, um, you know, people get off of uh, um, criminal activity they get away and people know and have evidence and see them and then they get away and then you opioses and i see like you ju judges and your lawyers is going to be recognizing shit that thing really works because i know that my clients was uh, um guilty but yet still this person get off and it's, it's as if an awareness is going to be coming up where you opioses could be becoming a uh, forensic detective in the sense of investigating thing and recognizing, but whatever transpire with um something that you're working on and you're investigating it could be at the workplace and that sort of a thing. You're going to be recognizing that there is a, a whole lot of depths to a situation that was transpired and how people manipulated a situation um and how um, people at the workplace manipulated a situation and some of you are going to be start recognizing that, whoa, people will go to great lengths to get whatever they want to ac accomplish and you're going to be stepping back because it's as if your awareness is going to be awakened and you're going to be feeling the negative forces against around your colleague or, and people around you that you're going to be knowing directly, oh, that person is... Uh, working with that shit, that person, that person. And I see it's as if you guys are going to be looking at people and it's going to be removing people from your corporation um, where you recognize that these people have got in a corporation institution by um, people who manipulate the system in order to get them. So it's as if you're going to be weeding out um, the bad apples. It's as if you guys are going to be bringing back stability 
and weeding and getting out the bad apple out of a corporation institution. Wow, Ophios is congratulations. You're going to be successful um, because I see help is going to be coming in and success is going to be here. Congratulations. Choose one of the crystals to see what you're working on. I gotta go. Please remember to share, 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 subscribe, and subscribe. Uh, in order for you to get the extended, guys, you gotta subscribe, um, in order. Um, I think it's, uh, the second abandonment. Yeah. Namaste. Mm -hmm.